it's such an enriching experience and that if if you want your daughter or your son for Boys State, if you want them to be able to go take the next step in life, whether that's college or if that's the military or if that's a job, um, if you want them to be able to go to that and to feel empowered, to not be afraid to step up and, and speak their mind and their opinions, um, to speak out for others and to serve others, if you want to help find an environment where that can be encouraged in them, then this is the place to do it. Speaking as a parent who's had a son attend Boys State, I can tell you that um, I have seen changes in my own son after attending this week of the program that I never thought I would see. An air of confidence, um, a sense of accomplishment, um, just a, a little bit more of a swagger um, from being able to be at this program and compete among his peers. Um, I just think it's such a great um, experience for a young man to attend this program and to learn so much, not only about the government and about all the things we teach here, but about, but about himself. And uh, it's the experience that I had, and I know it's the experience that most of these kids have, that they learn that they are up to the task, that they can do this. You know, someone in their community, in their school, saw something in those young men who attend this program that led them to believe that they would be good candidates, that they could be good leaders. And when they get here, it's an affirmation. You know, it's, it's something that these young men find out on their own. You know, we step back, as staff members, we step back and let them do it themselves. And when they get it done and they do it right, um, it's just uh, an exhilarating feeling. And, and as a parent, you want to see your kids grow. You want to see them learn. And that's the best thing that we can give them is that, that confidence and that um, a comp sense of accomplishment that, that they get from Boy State. Because they have such a good understanding and a good grasp of the process of government and how they can play a part in it as citizens in real life, um, that's empowering. I mean, they leave inspired to write to their representatives, to register to vote when they turn 18, um, to be informed citizens and to participate. And then on top of that, I mean, I guess really underlying all of that is that we empower them to just be good citizens. We try to encourage them to learn what that is and decide what that means to be a good citizen. And once they figure it out, they realize that it's so much better than, than the alternative, you know? It's so much better to be loving and to be servant leaders. Um, and once they see that, they understand it and they enact it here, they're empowered to take that back into their real lives.